Jersey Plants. Um, this is the third event, third leg, four legged race. Um, thir 13 and 1 or 12 and 1. Um, got the top record. The tournament has been very, very challenging. Even though our records makes it seem like it's been very, very easy for us. It hasn't been had a lot of competitive games. Actually, we've only had one blowout. Um, last night was a tough game, it was late night. Um, 9 o'clock here, 12 o'clock on our time. So um, I think guys were a little worn down. And that just shows you that, um, you know, at any given night, in this kind of event, when you have teams of this caliber, if you're not on top of your game, you can lose. So I think it was a little bit of a wake up call. It's a good thing uh, for us, I think, to not have the pressure of being undefeated going into the Peach Jam, you know, getting that, that monkey off our back. And now we can just go back to, you know, doing what we do and try to try to win the chip down in Augusta. Coach, can you highlight a couple of your players that performed well in, um, in the league in the last three sessions? Um, actually, we have about six kids that were, that were doing fairly well. Uh, Miles Mack uh, was really up to stop. Coming into AU season, people didn't know whether he was a mid-major or a major. Uh, he's clarified himself as a definite major now. Uh, Miles Davis, same thing. He's a definite major. Kyle Anderson, you know, high school season was, was average. Uh, he's had a great spring. So he's, he should be back up in one of the top players in 2012. Uh, then you have Desmond Hughes, one of the top five centers in America. He's been steady all spring. Uh, Derek, Derek Randall. Uh, another 6'8 kid we have who's being recruited um, very highly. Um, and Vaughn Gray. Vaughn Gray is uh, kind of like the secret weapon. Nobody knows about him. He comes in every night, gets his 15 points, seven rebounds, four assists. You know, so um, I think his stock has gone up as well. I even saw an article where somebody was saying, you know, Big East schools should start looking at him. Um, he definitely should play worst case scenario like Atlanta 10 games. Um, so. Those guys have been, been very, very good. We picked up a new kid, DeJuan Lighty, who's come in. He hasn't hurt us. Hit some jump shots, proving that he belongs. So we're just ready to go down to Georgia and we'll see what happens.